good morning, don't trip fam. Hangover gang, what it do? How y'all doing today? It's another beautiful day. You know, thankful to be alive, thankful to see another day. It's a lot of people who don't have the opportunity to be here with us today. So for that, I'm forever grateful. Another day to keep pushing. Another day to keep hanging in there. You know, don't lose hope. Keep grinding. Keep pushing. Whatever it is that you're doing, keep at it, you know. It's all going to work out in the end. With that said, Tom McDonald, we deep in the rabbit hole now. But we got to keep going. No turning back. American dreams next up. Let's get straight to it. We're making murderers famous. They kill a bunch of kids and get another from pages. I don't know none of the victims. I know the guns in the system promote the ones who are dangerous. It's become entertainment. We got t-shirts and posters covered in murderers' faces. We got movies getting made for train killers and saviors and parents leaving kids alone at home with guns in the basement. Would you pull me from a burning car? Run to get your phone so you can film a yellow world star. Uh -huh. A gun don't make a soldier with a purple heart. A gun cannot protect us if we don't know where our morals are. Mm, 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 mm. Oof. A gun cannot protect us if we don't know where our morals are. Facts. Facts. It's like putting a gun in a kid's hands. Like, they don't know any better. So, it, it, it could go either way, you know. But it's... But aside from all the gun shit... I like how he said something about if I was in a burning car, would you come help me out or would you rush to your car to get a phone for World Star? Like, I like that he t he low key touched on that social media part. Let's get back to it. Would you pull me from a burning car, run to get your phone so you can film a yellow World Star? Mm -hmm. A gun don't make a soldier with a purple heart. A gun cannot protect us if we don't know where our morals are. Uh -huh. Students fill the classes and the graves, and you claim it's a conspiracy to take your guns away. All the while, the family's torn apart and trying to ask why the son deserved to die at his desk in his class. We don't want a politician making money off a bully. Holes. They're digging our grave, the harm of the brave has gone up in flames. Give up about the system. We're not doing what we're told. The land of the free is armed to the teeth. American dreams. We're distracted by free porn and compilation videos of puppies and kittens. Uh -huh. While our children use the internet to bully one another and then purchase ammunition. So addicted to your phone that you ignore the kids and never give them any supervision. So they learn the little bomber things you keep inside your kitchen and you wonder how they ended up with life inside a prison. Facts, facts, facts. Yeah. Yeah. You gotta fight change on two fronts. You're fighting to change at the adult level. You know, you're trying to change the adults and help them see differently. But you're neglecting the kids because you're too caught up in this other shit. Social media, your own shit, drugs, whatever it is. You're too caught up in that to supervise the next generation. And it's like that cycle keeps continuing. It's like all these kids grow up and they pick up these bad habits off the internet. Because the internet's everywhere. You can literally hop on. Anybody can, you know. But it's not supervised. So these kids hop on there and they're feeding off these different things. And it's shaping them. And in turn, they grow up and become adults who the cycle continues, man. But neglect for the kids is definitely a big thing. Woo. You learn to build Obama things you keep inside your kitchen. And you mm -hmm. wonder how they ended up with life inside a prison. Prison. That gorilla, but don't care when it's a person. We're forgetting that we're human. We're angry the chickens are being locked up in cages, and then forget we do the same to kids in our institutions. When they ask you about stupid, you tell them they should Google it, then wonder why the troubled youth are homicidal lunatics. Mm. You think it's tragic when a shooter kill a student, but then say it's all a plan for them to change the constitution. Oh, yeah. Especially like recently, we had the uh, the school shooting in Tulsa, I think in Texas, and that one was a true tragedy. That was. That type of shit should not be happening. It should not be happening, man. It should not be happening. And it's usually kids, school shooters. It's not like it's a grown-ass man. It's these kids because they go through so much and they don't know how to deal with it. It's It's got them fucked up on all types of levels, but they have nowhere to go and nowhere to deal with it. The adults don't, don't give them a time of day. So they go to the internet or they go to each other or they go to these rappers who are putting out all this... 
you know, all this information that's not that's not really productive or healthy for them. They feed off it. They're on drugs and they've made all these different types of things. Lifestyle is cool. And it's like, don't be surprised when shit pops off because y'all are not dealing with it from both ends. I want a politician mm-hmm. making money off a bully. Oh, they're digging our graves. The home of the brave has gone up in flames. Give up about the season. We're not doing what we're told. The land of the free is on to the teeth. American dreams. Yesterday will be the same as tomorrow. If we don't wake up today. We don't want a politician Making money off the bully Hoes They're digging our graves The home of the brave has gone up in flames Give up about the system We're not doing what we're told The land of the free is hard to the teeth American dreams You know, it's like liquor, alcohol Cigarettes, drugs, use responsibly, you know? They're not stopping you from using it. They're saying if you're going to use it, use it responsibly. And that's another conversation that keeps coming up because you got some people saying, hey, restrict gun use and gun access, access to guns, restrict it. But you have this other side that's like, oh, you're taking away our amendment, right, blah, blah, blah. So it's like, okay, if you're going to use these guns, use them responsibly. You know, you have to find the balance between all that shit. Land of the free, home of the brave. And it's like, mm, a lot of these motherfuckers got guns. But how many of them are responsible with it? You know? Some people be road raging. These school shootings, you got kids. Like, little kids. And they are the future. And we're not protecting them, you know? That shit was sad. It's like, these politicians, like, get the fuck out. You know? Get the fuck out. Because you, you you ain't doing shit. You just care about the money, the position, the power. That's so, it. You know, you, you, you don't really care about bringing change and I'm not really big on politics like that because I don't I don't fuck with a lot of the shit they be doing or they stand for because they don't be doing shit that we need they be doing some other shit you know it's like ugh but once again Tom McDonald with the song for the people for the nation for the country trying to push the topic trying to push the topic and bring change once again he's really a voice for the streets really a voice for the people Big ups to you, Tom. As always, you already know what to do. Go do it. I'm going to catch you on the next one. We're about to get into the spoken words. It's about to be good. I'm going to do all of them and drop them today. Let's see. We got War is Coming, Not Alone, Anxiety, and Anarchy. So I'm going to drop all of those today. Stay tuned for that, and I'm going to catch you on the number. Let's get it. <laughs>